Yo, what's up, Van? Have warm up beers. I'm on it. I'm on it. Never do this, but I'm doing it. All right. So this is going to be fun. I got to, uh, it's been crazy because I was a, a massive binge drinker alcoholic back in the day. So like me and my wife were laughing because like already I was like, maybe I could add a shot here and there. <laughs> I have seven beers in the cooler. So I have one in case I have a couple minutes to spare at the top. I'll pound down another one at the top. If I make it to the top, we'll see. I uh, wanted to try and like eat something. Oh, so you'll see, little bro. There's gonna be a a comment will pop up. The rules. So basically, the rules are: I have to get to the bottom of the climb. Once I cross the start banner of the climb, time starts. I have to stop. I have to chug a beer. I can't start riding until I finish the first beer. Then there's 21 turns on this climb. So the second beer has to be drank between turn number 19 and I have to finish it before I get to turn 18. Or by the time I get to turn 18. Then I've got to do the third beer from turn 15 and I have to finish it by the time I get to 14. Then 12 to 11. I, I don't even know. A comment's going to pop up with the rules to help me remember. It's like 19 to 18, 15 to 14, 12 to 11. Oh, man, I don't know. I don't know. I just know I got to drink six beers. There are rules. Yo, what's up, Bike Beast? It's happening. It is happening. Jimmy Dukes! What's up, Jimmy? Yeah, and so, like, that's the thing, is, like, this is already a really tough climb, and a sub-hour climb up this mountain is something that a lot of people try to go for. Like, it's not something that everybody can do. Then to throw in, like, you got to chug six beers in that hour while you're climbing this mountain. Yo, old is in the house! What up, baby? That's my fucking die-hard army bro right there. America. America, baby. You know, we got to represent. I'm chugging beer. I'm chugging six of them on this ride, Jimmy. This is the beer out, baby. There's rules. Puking is a disqualifier. This is just my pregame. This is just... The, the challenge hasn't even started yet. Oh, nice. Olds drinking beers. I think my little bro's drinking with me. God tits, but on a mouse. That's a little bro. Yeah, Jimmy, so when I get to the bottom of this climb, I'm gonna start at 7.30. Start the climb at 7.30, but there's specific rules. I gotta drink a beer. I gotta start at a certain turn, and I have to have that beer finished by the time I reach the next turn. Ooh, my little bro's drinking wine, yeah. Yeah, so this is a challenge that Swift, Swift enthusiasts like to try. Yo, Pat, what's up, man? Savarice, what's up, bro? Oh, nice. Hell yeah, Pat. It'll be on here to watch afterwards, the VOD. See, like when I could when I drank I could drink like a fucking champion I could put some fucking drinks down I just haven't had it I haven't drank really in like two years <laughs> so it's funny I was telling my wife I was stressing about this ride almost as much as I was about like CRL uh, week two it just because the reason I haven't drank in two years is because the hangover. 
that I experienced the last two times I drank like I drink. Bro, we drank so much. I was just talking to somebody yesterday or something, talking about how we used to just put down 30 packs to our domes. I think I drank like 28 maybe on my 30th birthday. Yeah, dude, crazy. And that's not even like counting shots and all that shit. And like, crazy, I don't even like the taste of beer anymore. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> dude, Z ZRL week two, I have never been so stressed for a ride. Yeah, man. The last two times I got shit faced. Because that's I just drink until I black out. Which is usually three, four o'clock in the morning, you know what I mean? Um, but like the last time, if I moved my finger like that much, it would start spinning and then I dry heave. I had already thrown up everything that I had in my system. So then I was like super dehydrated. And I was like, oh, I'm so fucking thirsty. I would take a sip of water and dry heat for like five minutes trying to puke that up. And I'd just be like, oh, fuck it. Just chug a shit ton of water. And then just throw it up. But I was just trying to like <laughs> lubricate everything, man. I was so dehydrated. Yeah, and I love waking up feeling fresh and being able to go for a badass bike ride now. I'd much rather do that than be miserable for like a couple days trying to recover from poisoning myself. Wave to the sloth. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. I don't want to, like, see, I want another beer already. Yeah, we would just, yeah, hair of the dog, baby. Just get that buzz first thing in the morning. Like, I could have my wife just bring me another beer. And what's funny is she's an actual nurse. <laughs> this used to be my medication. Nurse! Okay, I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do with these cans. Don't waste a drop. Oh man, it's coming up soon. I got till 7.30. So I set the event for 7.30, so I'm not going to start the challenge itself until 7.30, but we're, I'll sit and drink and we'll bullshit. David J. Old with the follow. Welcome to the party, pal. Thanks, brother. It's a Michelada making motherfucker. I hate Micheladas. These things are nasty. Keep that out my mouth. There's nobody around here right now. Nobody wants to go climb out. Actually, nobody wants to ride up around the jungle. That's what it is. Hard Claws is here. What up, baby? May as well crack this sucker open. Ona's V-Bone. Ona's V-Bone. David. No, it's not 7.30 yet, but we're just pre-gaming. I'm going to go get ready for the challenge. Put us right by the KOM start banner. I mean, yeah, kind of. Every 10 minutes, I guess, huh? What's up, Texas? How you doing, baby? Gotta prime the tank. Prime the tank. Let's prime it, baby. Cheers to everybody who's drinking with me. I'll be singing one of my famous drinking songs on this ride. Actually, I should probably do that before I start the challenge, because I don't know that with a tummy full of beer climbing up Alp, if I'm going to be able to sing you guys my song. Hard Claws is working. And watching the beer out, baby. Work smart, not hard, hard claws. Okay, so the banner's up here, so I'm gonna slow my guy down a little bit. Coming up here up this little bump of a hill. 
<laughs> Tell an old story about you and Dave in Germany. Oh, God. Oh, God. I don't know if this is TV appropriate. Yeah, I stopped before, yep. God, I'm trying to think, man. All we did was fucking drink. I mean, I'll tell the story of when we got back from our first and really rough deployment. And we had a shit ton of money in our bank accounts. Um, we got back a bunch of money. We had 30 days of leave after our 15-month deployment. Okay, dude's got to stop. Inch him up here. Yeah, yeah. He gets stuck as the timer starts. Yeah. Go tell it on the mountain, brother. Um, so anyways, me, old, and my buddy Fox, our buddy Fox, all decided to go to we tried to go to Prague. We were gonna go to the Czech Republic. We're gonna go to Prague and we were gonna go to this competition bar. Uh, oh, don't worry, I got a bunch of drinking songs coming up for the tunes on this uh, stream. So, we we're going to go to this competition bar. It's a brilliant idea for a bar, especially back in my drinking days. So, every table has a tap, and your tap counts how many liters comes out of that tap. And so, there's a scoreboard above the bar that shows all the different tables. And so, the tables were competing against each other to drink the most amount of liters. And, uh, so we were trying to go to this bar, and then, of course, going to the Czech Republic, supposed to be beautiful Eastern European women. We were going to spend lots of money on them, and uh, <laughs> we didn't have passports, and so we got kicked off the train by the Czech uh, police, Czech Republic police. And, uh, dude, it's a brilliant idea for a bar. Like, brilliant. I I'm surprised nobody around... I I'm surprised there isn't a bar like that in America. It's It's brilliant. Um, so we get turned around, we have to hop back on this train, and we end up stopping in this weird village. There was nothing there for us to do. We had to wait for this next train to take us back to, I think we were going to go to, oh, uh, now I'm drawing blanks, Ber Berlin? I think we are going to Berlin. Um, so anyways, or no, we decided to go to Hamburg, Hamburg, which is like the Las Vegas of, um, of Germany and so we go there and they have this famous Reaper bond which is the no this was Frankfurt oh my god so many we went to so many red light districts there we go to Berlin I think I think it was Berlin we go to this club all of us no luck with the ladies because we're too shit-faced because we always pre-game way too hard before we even got out to the clubs so we hop in the cab we tell this dude take us to the best take us to the best red light district take us to the best whorehouse He's like, okay. So he takes us. You have to walk downstairs. There's an ATM right there. And it's 60 euros just to go past the madam into the, the main area where all the ladies are at. So we go draw out our money. You get two free drinks. The girls can't talk to you until you finish your first drink. So me and Dave go in there. Uh, it was like, like little kids in a candy store. And... Uh, so anyways, we get an hour, and our buddy Fox is still debating. He gets an hour after we had gotten ours. So then we come out before he does. We're sitting down at the bar. We're like, where's Fox at? And the lady at the bar is like, hey, your your buddy got another hour. And we're like, what? We're like, well, we ain't getting another hour. So we left. And Fox comes out after his hour, and the bartender tells him the same thing. Your buddy's got another hour. So Fox goes and pays for another hour. It was 600 euros per hour. So 1,200 euros. 1,000 euros was like, like something like 1,200 bucks or something, maybe more. <laughs> so we get to, uh, <laughs> I mean, come on, you're in Germany. Um, me and Old get back to the hotel and we're outside smoking a cigarette. We had, I think we had breakfast at like the little hotel uh, breakfast bar because it's like 6 a.m. <laughs> and we eat breakfast, we come out, we're smoking a cigarette, and here comes this taxi cab. And you, you can see Fox in the back seat in the window just yelling at us, flipping us off. Like, <laughs> the taxi cab makes a U turn. He comes pulling up. <laughs> you fucking assholes. I 
spent a thousand euros in that place and you guys fucking took off. He had no idea. Like the the bartender played. They played it perfectly, man. They got another six hundred euros out of this dude. <laughs> he was so pissed, so pissed. But just him, him across this main road in Berlin, <laughs> just yelling through the window. Oh god. But like just the shenanigans leading up to even us getting to Berlin on the train. It was crazy, man. There was this nun there, and we got all sorts of crazy pictures with her, and... Uh, yeah. Good times. But, I mean, that's all we did, man. We just drank. I I wasted all of my time in Germany. I didn't see any of, like, the... You know, we went to Frankfurt, went to Berlin, didn't see any of the famous, like, uh... uh what's the shit? The Berlin Wall? We didn't see any of that shit. We didn't see... What's the... Zone sector or whatever? You know, we didn't do... Charlie, Gate Charlie or whatever, something. Um, we just went to go to the clubs and try and get laid and, and just drink our asses off. That's it. The nun. Oh, God. The nun. <laughs> the nun. She was sitting in this bench on the train, and we were, like, sitting right around her. She, there was a poster. <laughs> There's a poster to her left that said H-A-L-T. D I C H F E S T Halt Dick Fest. <laughs> so, so we were just dying, man. We took fucking pictures of her with the Halt Dick Fest. Right? Then, uh, I was such an asshole, man. I was such a drunken asshole because we just had like a backpack full of weed. This trip all spawned. We were partying at this club the night before, and it went into like four or five a.m. We come back to the barracks and. We were just like, let's go to Prague. So we hadn't even gone to sleep yet. We just grab a backpack full of beer and we just hop on trains and start trying to make our way to the Czech Republic all shit-faced. Uh, this poor lady though, man, she's sitting there and she's got her legs underneath the table going on to the other bench seat. And I'm this asshole that's just like, you know what? Uh, I'm a fucking, I can sit wherever I want. And I went and made her move her legs and I sat right across from her. <laughs> just kind of like hung out with her for however long, and then I ended up falling asleep, took a nap on the table, like, put my head down on the table, and she just sat there the whole time. Yeah, dude, I was, I was such an asshole. Beer geek, what's up, baby? Uh, we're almost two beers in, but we haven't even started the challenge yet. We're free game. Beer geek is here. Oh, you're gonna hate me for drinking this beer on this challenge, but everybody told me to go light. I was like, man, I don't want to be a bitch and show up with Coors Light. I'm gonna get some, like, 7% stuff. And then people that have actually done this were like, yo, go light. Oh yeah, I got Coors Light, baby. <laughs> we tapping into the Rockies today. This was my go-to. I was telling my wife when I opened up the first one for dinner, like it didn't taste that good. I don't even like to taste the beer anymore, but the more I drink it, the more I'm recalling everything, you know? And then the stories, it's just all so nostalgic. It... <laughs> yeah, this is not a good idea. Now, see, I'm, I'm, I, I can't drink as much as I, as fast as I would normally drink it, man. I gotta do six of these while climbing this damn mountain, man. Need a koozie. I do need a koozie. That's a great idea. I got my puke bucket. I got my puke bucket just in case. <laughs> so it's over here. It's ready to not be used. But we'll keep the puke bucket in sight. That way you guys can see this. There and empty. <laughs> Get a key and shotgun that shit. Get out of here. I was going to go to my parents and grab one of their uh, pool noodles. You know those long little fucking tubes that got the hole in the center? Well, we used to just fucking fill those suckers up as little noodle bongs. <laughs> it's actually the corn gall. I'm climbing the corn gall right now. Uh, I mean, that's what I'm going to do, but it disqualifies me from actually being able to say that I completed the beer up if I throw up. It's a, it's a DNF, did not finish. Only, only like, of the streamers, I think it looks like Hagen does. And here, you know what? I can go hop on the Wall of Beasts. Don't worry, we're gonna change the tunage. I got appropriate tunage for this um, for this challenge. 
All right, so let's go to Bike Beast. Let's see, workout, or no, no. Where is it? It's the wall, or the wall of beasts. Ugh. So apparently the worst part about this is the stomach shit. All right, so who's completed this? Hagen Daz has completed it the fastest time with 58 minutes and 13 seconds. Jet Reset completed it in one hour and four minutes and 51 seconds. Zavarice, who's in chat, completed it in one hour, 20 minutes and 34 seconds. Ewan Mackey, who is a fucking animal on the bike, the dude is ridiculously strong, did not finish. He only got four beers in to turn nine. Slow Spoon, you guys know Slow Spoon, did not finish, only made it three beers in. Bert Skeets, big boy, big old Bert, did it in 119.59, but they have a asterisk saying weight altered, so I think he lightened himself to go up faster up the climb, but he drank the beers. So here's the rules. I gotta drink the first beer when I cross that little banner up there ahead of my rider on the right-hand side. So I'm gonna cross that banner, my guy's gonna stop, I'm gonna chug this first beer, and then I can start riding. Then I have to start drinking another beer at turn 19, and I have to finish it by turn 18, drink another one at turn 15, finish it by turn 14, drink another by turn 11, finish it by turn 10, start drinking another one at 7 to 6, 3 to 2. I packed another beer in the cooler in case I have a couple spare minutes at the top to chug down one. So that's how this is going to go. What a sissy. Where are you at? Oh shit, where are you at now? 5.30 a.m. Oh jeez. You overseas, boy. What a sissy. Fuck you guys. 58 minutes. 58 minutes, man. Hagen, I'm gonna try and I'm gonna try and beat. Actually, alright. I'll just be happy if I get 59-59. But my competitive mind is like, yo, I'm gonna try and beat Hagen. You're puking. <laughs> My little bro says I'm going to puke. See, like, I could totally do this two years ago when I was a mad drinker. Now I just, now I question it. I'm, I'm dreading the hangover, man. I'm seriously... Oh. I just worked 12 hours. I got to work tonight. All right, two minutes. Two minutes. Oh shit, Turkey. Hell yeah, bro. Thank you for your service. As always, Beer Geek guys, thank Beer Geek for his continued service in the army. He's over in Turkey right now. Yeah, Heart Claws is in the future. What is the outcome, Heart Claws? Do I make it or not? Heart Claws is like 19 hours in the future. Oh yeah, that's the dirt. Oh, just wait. So in November, they should have the Movember ride, which... Uh, is no shave November or whatever, and they have a, a, a straight up mustache kit. Just picked up where I left off. That's probably how it would go for me. I think, I feel like that's how it would go for me. I'm gonna get it in 69. Get out of here. Don't be a bitch, bro. Yeah, thanks, Jimmy. Yeah. I, I gotta get the, the actual stash kit, man. It's dope. Yeah, I was. Seriously, Weebles. I was so pissed I didn't get the, I didn't even know about that ride last year. Now that I know about it, I am not gonna miss that. I'll even go for a run just to get that running one too. Alright, I got 17.9 on my laptop. 17 or 729 on my laptop. Oh, here we fucking go. Here we fucking go. Oh my god. Oh. I'm gonna leave that for my sipping beer. <laughs> See, like, this is where my mind is at. Like, I gotta have a beer up here to sip on in case I get thirsty in between other beers. Alright, so here's beer number one. All right, don't worry, got a playlist. We're not gonna be jamming this shit. All right, 
There's no stopping it now. Gotta be ready. Cheers, boys. Uh, I did it right, right? Did I do it right? I'm, I'm, I'm not disqualified, right? I'm gonna drink till I die. Fuck yeah, let's do this. <laughs> ah. I gotta ease it. I gotta ease it back. Get too excited. <laughs> drink, motherfucker, drink, motherfucker, drink, Yeah, three point. Yeah, three point three. I think. But we, we're trying to beat Hagen. What's up, Casey? Yeah, three point two. Yep. Where's light, baby? It's now almost noon and the spinning has stopped. There'll be no more drink to the floor. I do grind. I'm kind of acting like it was a fucking PR attempt. Go hard early. Well, it's actually the Weeble's way. PTB with the raid. Thanks, Trouser. Appreciate you, bro. Hope you had a good workout. Go hard while you're sober. Yeah, but that's what I was gonna do the weeble way. It's going hard on these first couple turns because they're steeper. And then you ease off. Yo, Casey with the raid at party four. Thanks, man. Thanks, Ray. Or Casey. Look, I'm already getting intoxicated. Yeah, I chucked down my first one right after I crossed the banner. Like a fucking champion. There we go, Casey getting it. Yeah, 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 totally. That's just sound. Yeah, exactly, man. Fucking crazy bastard. I've been listening to this music for the last two days trying to build my, uh, playlist for this ride me and my wife are laughing at some of the lyrics man like especially listen to the uh the Ir the really irish ones because there's like some scottish ones some irish oh is that hagen oh there's hagen hagen's here So that Hagen dies with us, guys. I need to get these burps up. Weebles, you gotta do it, bro. I don't know. Seems kind of fun so far, so I'd do it with you. <laughs> Whoa, what the fuck is this? What is this? Marine. Marine. Yo, everybody do a hashtag Marine for 
Uh, say thanks to LePage. Thanks, LePage. Marine, you motherfucker. Thank you, bro. Thank you so much, bro. Oh, I got somebody messaging me. This guy from Facebook. Yo, what's up, Buttons? What's up, baby? Little page master, you're crazy. Thank you so much, bro. Oh, CK Buttons with the 500 bits? What the fuck? Buttons, thank you so much, bro. Thank you guys so much, man. <laughs> Tell me you're busy doing a beer up. Who's asking questions? What's going on? The page is a god. Thanks, buttons. Uh, there you go, physique. Not that big. <laughs> it's not that. It's a trash can. So it can catch everything. No, I don't. Wanna, I'm not using that puke bucket. I'm telling you, I'll I'll swallow that shit down. I'll chug it like I chug these beers. Oh yeah, baby, nothing but drinking songs tonight. <laughs> Beer for a corner. Yeah, have fun, Casey. Enjoy. There's Hagen. Let him pull me a little bit. I don't think this is even draftable, so. Beast in it. I feel good though. Like, I feel like the alcohol might numb the, numb the pain a little bit. Maybe I could beast a PR. <laughs> no. Oh shit. Oh shit. I gotta get a beer ready. This is where I need my wife. This is a short segment too. Finishing this shit, guys. No doubt about it. The old, the old alcoholic binge drinker in me woke up. Bring me a shot. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Yeah, don't pull a Ewan. What is Ewan's story? Because I saw that he didn't finish it. And Ewan's a freaking beast. Oh, he puked. <laughs> I'm all confident now. I know, damn it. There's only a second beer. Well, it's my fourth. Like whiskey beforehand, oh my god. I had two beers before this.
He was drunk before starting. Oh, God. Yeah, so... Oh, and then he went... Yeah. Then he tried to PR it. Or he mackied it. 400 watts. Yeah, he threw up. I'm four beers in, but that was two was pregame. Two are challenge beers. So I still got four challenge beers left. And I put a seventh in the cooler in case I make it with a couple minutes to spare. I'll pound down another at the top before finishing the KOM. A little ambitious. I know, I know. Who else is drinking with me? Is anybody else drinking with me? Happy Monday, guys. Happy Monday. Sorry I chose a Monday night for this. There was one. I just didn't get many responses. Uh, Hagen's in here. And the other dude from Facebook's down at the bottom of the climb. He's just started climbing not too long ago oh, oh god hey baby doing good doing good hey uh hey little girl um oh wait uh, i'm good right now i'll let you know Love you, baby. So this is actually like one of the welcome songs to like Oktoberfest in Germany. Yeah, I should have done this on a weekend, but my wife's schedule is all over the place, man. This worked out. Oh, shit, I gotta start drinking at 15. Ring da de liayo. Yeah, yeah, totally. She did. She actually came in and was like, You okay? Thanks, bro. She's beautiful. You got beautiful kids, too. What are you talking about? But thank you. Oh, fuck. Ring down, little guy. Sleeping Scotsman, quiet as can be, and lifted up his kilt about an inch so they could see. And there, behold, for them, the I mean, you know, I feel it for sure. My burps are uh, still gassy, so that's good. Was nothing more than God had graced him with upon his birth. They marveled for a moment. Then said we must be gone. Let's leave a present for our friend before we move along. As a gift they left a blue silk ribbon tied into a bow. Around the bunny star, the Scots kilt did lift and show. Ring ding diddle diddle daddy oh, ring di diddle i oh. Around the bunny star, the Scots kilt did lift and show. <laughs> well, the Scotsman walked to nature's call and he stumbled for the trees. Behind the bush he lifts his kilt and gawks at what he sees. And in a startled voice he says to what's before his eyes, Oh! God, I don't know where you've been, but I see that you won first prize. Ring, ding, diddle, diddle, daddy, oh! Ring, di, diddle, oh! Oh, Lord, I don't know where you've been, but I see that you won first prize. That was my other concern. 
old as Pippin. This dude messaging me, trying to join up with the ride. Oh, don't worry, LePage. I got a fucking song for you on here, bro. When I heard this song last night, I was like, I hope fucking hope LePage is in this stream when this comes on. Yo, Zabarish with 100 bits. Thanks, brother. Thank you so much. I wish I could have seen your guys' beer alps, man. Turn up the tunes. You got it. I think these German songs are going to be quieter for some reason, but thank you. Let me know. Let me know how that is. No, not a tall boy. Just a 12-ouncer. Mm. How's it now? I turned it up a little bit. I think it's just these German songs. On <laughs> a Wednesday night, floating kegs. Thanks, Jimmy Dukes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Purple's been good to me, bro. Just an amazing Zwifting community over here on Twitch, man. Bunch of awesome Zwift streamers. Super supportive of one another. So, gotta go where the love's at. Yeah, how am I doing on pace? I don't even know. I'm not even paying attention anymore. I'm getting buzzed. I'm just, I'm just saying. What was David's? What was David's vote? Kill switch? Nah. Drinking songs. Song is actually a sort of a race. Of music. I don't think Bro, I'm gonna be so, so hammered. Please God, if you can get it. It says, "Banya on bow is on jowla, and the juice of the barley for me." means the milk of the cow is all right for the calf. Later, Jimmy. Thanks for coming by, bro. Thanks, Jimmy. You too, man. In the sweet county Limerick, one cold winter's night, before the cross fires were burning when I first saw the light. Oh, shit, I didn't even see Hagen sitting here talking to me. When tipsy with joy, as she danced round the floor with her slip of a boy. Singing bunny on poets and gola, and the juice of the barley for me. Could even slow down a bit. Well, when I was a gossoon of eight years or so. How's the music now? Is it loud enough? Only primer to school I did go. To a dusty old schoolhouse without any door. Yeah, I gotta, I gotta ease it back a little bit. I can't be doing 320. Well, Master blind drunk on the floor. Saying Banyan Boys and Gona, and the juice of the barley for me. At the learning, I wasn't such a genius, I'm thinking. <laughs> Just think of like your heaviest weekend drinking. And that was just probably the daily for them. For five miles. 
I mean, yeah, you think about all those, like, people in Rome just sipping on wine constantly. They didn't fucking hydrate with water. They hydrated with wine. When do I gotta drink the next beer? Turn 11, right? Thanks, Z. And his words they did strike me the truth for today. <laughs> top is plan is to outlast the beer to the top before it gets to him. <laughs> the perfect life, I know, right? A couple years ago that would have been the perfect life. Last Kingdom, yeah. That's with uh Mark Wahlberg and Jamie Foxx, right? And there in that room. Ooh, and I use chammy butter. For the first time. Feeling great. The ball sack is feeling great. I don't feel like I'm sitting on the folds of my nut sack anymore. <sighs> Last Kingdom. Fuck, I don't know which one we're talking about now. It's like Vikings. No, I probably haven't seen it then. Dude, be the guy. Be the guy, Dave. I think I gotta take, oh, turns 11, so I gotta start drinking at turn 11 up here. Yeah, I'll have to check it out. Last Kingdom. Through the teeth, past the gums. Look how liver here it comes. Hagen's message to me. Fucking drink. Barely lost any fitness, I swear. Yeah, he barely lost anything. He disappears for months, does the same fucking ride over and over on Strava, reappears, and is just as strong as he was when he left. Hagen, you fucking animal. Alright, here we go. Everybody says hello, Hagen. Cheers to you for riding with me. I think he's in stream, but he's messed me on Twitch. All right. I gotta hold the pace. Hold the line. Hold the line. Oh. Hydrate, hydrate, hydrate. Thanks for page. Cheers to you, Marine. Oh fuck. Going course like Casey. Cheers, fuckers. Higgins says, hello, everyone. Keep the watts up and the beer down. <laughs> yeah, it is, Z. That was like a fucking sip I shouldn't have even taken. All right, folks. Like nothing there. Up on this next song. I hope you all know your part. 
Oh, so the other guy is six, 16 seconds behind us. S. Urker. I saw a horse outside my door where my own horse should be. So I called me wife. Uh. And I said to her, would you kindly tell to me who owns that horse outside my door where my own horse should to be? be. Uh, yep. No, four? I don't even know. It's like a few beers. Plus two pre gaming. But a sow with a saddle on it, sure, I never saw before. And as I came home on Tuesday night, as drunk, drunk as drunk could be, I saw a coat behind the door. Coat behind the door? So I called me wife. Fucking right, Weebles. And I said to her, Would you kindly tell to me who owns that coat behind the door where my own coat should be? I feel like my bong alp should be on the wall of, wall of beasts. We're going to try and get some more potheads doing that shit. Oh no, on the carpet. Blanket with buttons on it, sure, I never saw before. And as I came home on Wednesday, who was with the shade? Be, <laughs> I saw the pipe upon the chair where my own pipe should be. You need to do it twice, really so set the I bar, yeah. Hey, wife. Hey, wife. And I said to her, 11, 10, me, 10, 7, 6. Oh, well, that pipe oh we got a couple of turns to go, nice. Megan says, Cheers, everyone. He's drinking too. That's a lovely tin whistle that my mother sent to me. Ah, but many a day I've traveled a hundred miles or more. But tobacco in a tin whistle, sure I never saw before. And as I came home on Thursday night, as drunk as drunk could be. I've seen this man do great things for our country. I've seen you do great things for your country, good sir. Yo, Alyssa, what's up? No, her, no, 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 God, no. Me, so I'm the type of guy that boots, if I drink bed, and then smoke weed, be. I get the spins and start throwing up. I can't mix the two. I'm going to chug extra just because anyways. Oh, I'm getting fucking sub 60. Got this liquid courage going right now. Night, as drunk, as drunk Stops. Oh God. Yeah, I'm the guy that's like, well, okay, not a bad so idea. Me wife. I'm in for a good time. And I said to her, would you kindly tell to me who owns that head up on the bed? Where I mean, you know, back in my drinking days. I would try and put down like, you know, I would challenge myself to maybe like a 12 pack, but at the same time, oh, drink my pacing beer. Z, thank you, brother. Good looking out. Cheers. Whiskers, sure I never saw before. And as I came home on Saturday night, as drunk as drunk could be, I saw you the buffalo bike the first on a beer out. My own thing should be. So I called me wife. Hey, wife. <laughs> this is sad. Fucking telling people what hard liquor I got and for I shots. Get out of here. Would you kindly tell to me who owns that thing beneath the sheets where my own. This is the first time I've ever been buzzed on a bicycle. Oh, I haven't felt this feeling in a while. A hundred miles or more, but a hammer with a head like that. Sure, I never saw the before. lips are starting to. When well, my lips start going a little numb. Came home on Sunday night, as drunk as drunk could be. I <laughs> saw a man outside my door at corner. And my stomach's three. starting to turn, Casey. So I called me wife. And I said to her, "Would you kindly tell to me?" Who was that man outside my door at quarter after three? Oh, nice. And then drink. Oh, nice. 
travel a hundred miles away. But an Englishman who can last. What song are we on right now? I don't even know. Is this the before. same drunk as drunk before? Song? I can't keep up with chat. I'm too, too buzzed to keep up with chat at this time. No, I'm not questioning making this at all. But there's no way in hell. Okay, hold on. How are we looking on time? Am I just blazing up this thing right now? Consumption took me mother and me father got the box. I'll take a shot. Me brother drank the whiskey till he wound up in a box. Me other brother in the truck. Nice, Casey. Thanks, brother. Don't try math now. I know. I'm like sitting here trying to. Now everybody's died. So until our tears are dry, we'll drink and drink and drink. So what, should I drink more and just kind of slow down a little bit? We'll dance and sing and fight until the earth. Kind of having a good time right now. We'll throw up, pass up, wake up, and then go drinking once again. Kenny was killed in Kilkenny, and Claire, she died in Clare. Tip from Tipperary died out in the dead year. Shannon jumped into the river, Shannon back in June. Alright, called the wife in. He fell into the earth. You are behind. What do you mean I'm behind? Cleanliness is godliness, me uncle Pat would sing. He broke his neck, a slipping on a bar of Irish ping. Dude, I think the, I think the buzz, like numbing the pain of the legs. 300 is a feel like shit rush. Now everybody died. See, right as I say that, see with the most knowledgeable comment. Don't get too confident. Until the early morning light, then we'll throw up, pass up, wake up, and then go drinking once again. I gotta drink it, what, turn seven? When's that? It's coming up, right? Ooh, nice. That's a long one, too. That's a good one. That's an easy beer right there. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Hold on. Higgins like, don't you fucking whore, keep it in. He wasn't really Irish, but he went to Notre Dame. McNamara crossed the street and by a bus was he But he was just a Scotman, so nobody gave a shit. Oh. Now everybody's died, so until our tears are dried, we'll drink and drink and drink and drink and then we'll drink some more. We'll dance and sing and fight until the early morning light. Then we'll throw up, pass up, wake up, and then we'll drink him once again. Da, da. Drunken Uncle Brendan tried to drive home from the bar. The road rose up to meet him when he fell out of his car. Irony was what befell me great grand Uncle Sam. He choked upon the very last potato in the land. Connor lived in Ulster Town, he used to smuggle arms. Until the British killed him and cut off his lucky charms. And dear old father Flanagan, who left the Lord's employ, drunk on sacramental wine beneath the altar boy. Now everybody's died, so until our tears are dry. We'll drink and drink and drink and drink and then we'll drink some more. We'll dance and sing and fight until the early morning light. Then we'll throw up, pass up, wake up, and then go drinking once again. Someday soon I'll leave this world of pain and toil and sin. The Lord will take me by the hand to join our lovely kin. Me only wish is when the Savior comes for me and you. He kills the cast of Riverdance and Michael Flatley too. Now everybody's died, so until our tears are dried, we'll drink and drink and drink and drink and then we'll drink some more. We'll dance and sing and fight until the early morning light. Then we'll throw up, pass up, wake up, and then we'll drink him once again. Then we'll throw up, pass up, wake up, and then we'll drink him once again. Then we'll throw up, pass up, wake up, and then we'll drink him once again. Oh shit, I'm muted. I was muted, my bad. Uh, I'm getting intoxicated, so I need those reminders. Thank you guys very much. Appreciate you. But, uh, I don't know what the fuck I was saying. I don't care. Oh, okay. Oh, water. Houses, no bar to take us buses, no party cakes or cans to celebrate. 
no deliriums of visions, regrettable decisions, no excuses to be coming home too late. So brothers, sisters, it's time to take a stand. You can fry my beer from my cold dead hand. Raise them up. Oh, I got a fucking drinking song for you, Casey. Raise them down. Yeah, raise them up. Raise them up and drink them down. and shit. Oh. Ooh, a beer out race. I'm going to watch that shit. Okay, so here's the song. I got drunk last night. I got drunk the night before. Gonna get drunk tonight like I never got drunk before. When I'm drunk, I'm as happy as can be. For I am the member of the Dietrich family. Oh, the Dietrich family is the best family that ever came over from old Germany. Oh, God. There's the Rotterdam Dutch and the Potterdam Dutch. Amsterdam Dutch and the goddamn Dutch. Glorious, glorious. One keg of beer for the four of us. One of us could drink it all alone. Oh, God. Glory be to God that there are no more of us. Because one of us could drink it all alone. Oh. Horrible idea. I love you guys. Oh, that beer's done. I finished that beer. This is my, this is my pace beer. Z. With the reminder to take a drink, thanks, Z. <laughs> so, you know what's awesome about that song? When I was stationed in Germany, we used to go to these big fucking festivals. Americans don't have drinking songs. We got 99 bottles of beer on the wall. So, I taught some of my buddies that song. We'd fucking sing that shit, dude. They would lose their fucking minds in Europe. Hey, did you guys know Red Solo Cups? Casey, great point. Did you guys know Red Solo Cups? All those lines, those levels, they're all different shit for like a shot a glass of wine, a beer. Oh, wait, shit, music. Guys. Guys, I'm intoxicated, so I'm going to need all the help I can get to keep this stream functioning as it should. Yeah, they had no idea Americans had an actual drinking song. Well, we do. I'll teach it to all of you guys. What did Texas say? What did Texas say? <laughs> Fuck that song, Toby Keith. <laughs> well, we've assessed the pros and cons, taught it both the rights and wrongs, the hellfire into which we could be hurled. No, get that point into your face. You How are we doing on time? You doing good? Race. You're yeah, making this. for the future of the world. So, brothers and sisters, it's time to take a stand. Yeah. You can fry my. 
Cheers. Fuck him. Cheers, guys. Raise him up and trick him down. Getting drunk, guys. First time in two years. I'm a love in life right now. Um, I'm gonna do the tribute. To Here you go, LePage. LePage, this is for you. I'm gonna crank it up for LePage. When you start any tribute to the armed services, you always start with well, the. Let me know if it's too loud. Why? Because by the time you've got to the end of it, they've understood the first line. It would be a fucking shit show, Texas. <laughs> well, shit could be the virtual the pedestrian that gets hit by him. <laughs> How you can tell a marine working on an oil rig at sea? He's the one throwing bread to the incoming helicopters. Here, birdie, birdie, nice bird. Here, this is a good one. How you Marine stand for suicide? Throw a shovel full of sand against a brick wall and tell him to hit the beach. Fireball shots. Oh, I love you know fireball. What the word Marine stands for? Muscles are required. Intelligence not essential. Muscles are required. Intelligence non essential. You fucking Marines. Ooh, some army people over there. What do you call a Marine with an IQ of 70? General. <laughs> General. How can you tell when a Marine has been using your oh, computer? Fucking Marines. White out on the screen. I love you guys. Love you, LePage. Now, you also know that the Marines hymn is the most versatile song ever written in the United States. I know States. we give each other shit. Can sing it to any melody. This is the branch thing. You know what's up. You don't believe me? Look, see, I'm what's getting drunk and I'm all like getting, getting tight with LePage right now. You know what's up, LePage. You know what's up, bro. Have to settle for 10. You know what I do for you, bro. From the halls of Montezuma to the shore. I gotta get my wife in here so you can give me a shot. We will fight our country. When's the next three and two? Seven and six, three and two. On land and sea. Or like this. From the halls of Montezuma to the shores of Tripoli. We will fight our country's battles in the air and land and sea. First to fight for right and freedom and to keep our honor clean. We're proud I'm gonna to face, the face time my wife so I get in here. Or like this. From the halls of Montezuma to the shore of Tripoli. Can you bring me a shot? We're coming here real quick. Come in here. Fight for right and freedom and to keep our honor clean. <laughs> the wife. The wife is like, um, I don't know if I want to bring you a shot. I know your history with alcohol. 31 viewers, guys, thank you so much. I am cycling with Doc. I was in the army for seven and a half years. That's where I got all my drinking experience from. Went to Afghanistan twice, drank even more afterwards. And I just want to, well, cycling helped me quit drinking two years ago. <laughs> Whoa. I just had to swallow some, uh, some cute bubbles. We calm down the watts a little bit. Traditional version. calm down the watts a little bit. The Zuma, the shores of Tripoli. We will fight our country's battles in the air and land and sea first to fight for right okay what was i saying i don't even remember i found cycling to be the best therapy and medication for my ptsd in day-to-day -day life so i'm trying to get a shot bro my wife won't come in here my stomach does say otherwise, though. Air Force I just want to put that out there. I just almost threw up and had to swallow it back down. Off we go into the wild blue yonder. I'm trying. I'm trying, LePage. I'm trying. I don't think my wife supports this shot idea. And now the airborne. Yeah. Oh. The men who fly the planes, the <laughs> there she is. The there she is. Come here, baby. The loop, the loop, what kind of booze zero we got? Feet. The pilot tried to loop the loop at zero zero Not doing feet. tequila. The pilot Not doing vodka. The loop at zero zero feet. We have any feet fireball? Gonna fly no more. Go I know we don't have fireball. What a hell of a way to die. Go oh, oh wait, wait, wait. Hell of a way to die. 
Gory, gory, what a hell of a way to die. And he ain't gonna jump. No. Oh, wait, here's the airborne. And now the men and women who jump from the Fucking water. airborne! Rangers, Green Berets. Let's go, little girl. Come here. From perfectly good airplanes with not a thing wrong with them. <laughs> and they say Marines are dumb. <laughs> there was blood upon the razor. There were brains say, upon the shoot. Contestants were a bad one from his paratrooper suit. He was a mess, they picked him up and poured him from his boots. And he ain't gonna jump no more. Gory, gory, what a hell of a way to die. I'll take tequila. Gory, gory, what a hell of a way to die. Gory, gory, what a hell of a way to die. He ain't gonna jump no more. The army, artillery. Was it high? Was it low? Boiler maker. Drop a shot in the last beer. The Coast Guard. The Coast Guard. Fuck the Coast Guard. Sorry if you're in the Coast Guard. I apologize. I'm by the I mean, it was the best choice of the options she gave you, Paige. No, it's uh, Classe Azul. Really good tequila. The Navy. Fuck the Navy, you fucking squids! LePage! LePage with another gifted no, sub. Bro, thank you so much, LePage. You're the man. Accurate, but wow, Peter! What's up, wow? Long time no see, bro. Last beer turn coming up. That means I'll be drinking number seven at the top, motherfuckers! In the morning. Shave his belly with a rusty razor. Shave his belly with a rusty razor. Shave his belly with a rusty razor. Early in the morning. My taste beer was my seventh beer, so I actually gotta. I actually gotta have my wife grab me another beer for the top. We'll put him in the bilge and make him drink it. Put him in the bilge and make him drink it. Drink more. Put him in the bilge and make him drink it. Dude, what's going on? Hold on. Let me chill. Let me check something. This feels too easy, guys. I'm max trainer difficulty. I'm we'll fucking make him beast skipper right now. Valdez, make him skipper of the Exxon Valdez. Make him skipper of the Exxon Valdez. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, shit. Are we on a, are we on a drinking? What turn am I on? Do I get a drink right now? See, thank you. How short is this turn? Oh, it's a short one. Oh, God. Lock him in a room full of bike pipe music. Lock him in a room full of bike pipe music. Early in the morning. Heave ho, and up she rises, heave ho, up she rises, heave ho, up she rises, her lie in the morning. Last one almost got me to puke. Heave ho, and up she rises, heave ho, up she rises, heave ho, up she rises, her lie in the morning. This is my PR Alp right now. 4815. Jeez, look how far behind that. Look how far behind that. Look how far behind that. Way back in history, when all there was to drink was nothing but cups of tea. A long tail man by the name of Charlie Mock, and he invented a wonderful drink and he made it out of hop. Hey, what to be in that world right, of soda and orange tea? And to his praises we shall all be. No one's trying to come up. And look what he has done for us, he filled us up with cheer. A long less Charlie Mock, the man who invented beer. No one's trying to come up. The Fury's bar, the Tansy's pub, the hole in the wall as well. Oh, wonder you can be sure of, it's Charlie's beer they sell. Come on, oh, me lucky lad, 11 o'clock she stops. A five o'clock second, remember Charlie Mops. One, two, Pretty much, pretty much the page. Dude, it is great.
Viper Red. I feel amazing other than that I'm trying to hold back puke right now. I'm a reasonable bitch, bro. You got that right. My wife knows that. This was never gonna not happen. All out sprint. Hard claws, you asshole. Alright, hold on. God damn it. Oh, I love you, Hard Claws. I love you so much. What? 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 Hey, you guys hear my wife? You guys hear my wife? She knows the rules. She's like, if you sprint, you'll vomit, and you lose. I'm at the top right when now. When you read, you start with A, B, C. I'll sprint. When you drink, you start with Do, After I finish. Me. Hard Claws. Do, Did you guys hear her? Could you actually hear her saying that? Ray, the guy who sells me beers. You just became a sex.
Almost. Never lock her door. Almost. But on the day she died, a lament sounded weak. For Mary McGregor finally got some sleep. Here we go. Oh, I'm, I'm well, Barney. I'm doing so good, bro. Now this is fucking content. Oh my god. A child, I'm told. I gave her my heart, and she gave me a Woo! So now I sit standing here. Out in the pouring rain. I'm so glad and cry I don't have to pain. race tomorrow. And I'm just DSing for my team. Somebody hit us in the please. Finish level one! Oh my god. Uh, is the music still playing? <laughs> Jackass with this shot. So it still stands at six beers. How's that now, Barney? Is that good? Thanks, guys. Thank you so much. Huh? I'm good, baby. I'm going to be done and I'm just going to descend down and uh, finish it up. <laughs> uh, there we go, there we go. Yeah, I cranked it up for the end. Can you hear it now? What's up, Ray? 5531. <laughs> Good fucking time. Good time drinking six beers, man. Hell yeah. I'm down. Thank you, guys. I'm intoxicated. I'm feeling great. I feel like I'm on top of the world right now. I haven't been drunk in two years. So I'm feeling good. Having a great time. Hagen with the raid. Thanks, brother. Dude, Hagen, thank you so much for riding with me, man. Oh. Dave, thanks, brother. Love you, bro. Love you, man. All right, don't worry, hard plus. I have not forgotten. I have not forgotten. <laughs> you would do this, though, hard plus, you fucking dick. <laughs> uh, yeah, go check out hard plus, man. Or, I mean, Hagen does. Hagen does. Thank you so much, bro. Thank you so much for riding with me, man. I, I got intoxicated and couldn't... Uh, couldn't pay attention to the comments anymore. Hey, you're the man. Thank you for joining me. Alright, I gotta get fucking hard claws and sprint. I have no idea, bro. You should just, I don't know, if you see, like, don't worry about it. I, I don't want your money. I don't want anybody to I'm just having fun with cycling, man. That's it. And streaming has just made it so much more fun than it works. <laughs> That's it, man. <laughs> he wants it. Flanagan's, Flanagan's, Milligan's, Gilligan's, 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 Gil
this song. <laughs> Gotta redo that part. I can read this, <laughs> Marine. I'm not as retarded as you, Marine. I hope one day we can all get together, ride bikes, and fucking drink. Hey, there's Urker! There's the guy that I've been trying to ride with this whole time. He, he responded to the ride on Facebook. <laughs> he finally caught me. How many fingers? I have no idea. I can't see fingers right now. Oh, that'd be cool. That would be cool. 